Well, it is a bit of a tough night for Gonzaga fans. This was a hard game to watch. Boy. We have won 31 of them, right. not, not this one. Karthik Venkatraman joins us now from the newsroom. Karthik, tonight's performance, not the normal Gonzaga team that we've seen all this season. To put it this way, I was in shock. Gonzaga looked like a team that, you know, this whole entire season was just so fantastic, but straight out the gates tonight, and you could just kind of tell that this one is going to go straight to Baylor at a blink of an eye. They were down by 19 points in the first half, but you have to give full credit to the Bears. They played a perfect game tonight. They jumped on Gonzaga early with the offensive rebounds, turned those into second chance points. It felt like they were taking every three and they were making every three. The defense was just way more active than Gonzaga tonight. The Bears were playing with a lot of energy. They came out and punched GU, and GU never really recovered from that hard punch. It was just a tough loss for Gonzaga tonight. Even as they got the offense going there in the second half, they'd eventually cut it to single digits. However, you know, Baylor had that huge response in which they'd go on a 9-2 run there to immediately put themselves back up. That single digit, uh, you know, deficit only lasted for 25 seconds before Baylor really got this thing going. Uh, you have to really start to wonder how flat GU was mentally and physically coming out of that final four game against UCLA that went to overtime. Obviously, a lot of emotions as Jalen Suggs hit that game winner from near half court. Uh, who knows? It was a one-day turnaround where they had to just get back and going again. I'm just not really sure how much it affected them. Mark Feud didn't really make excuses about it in the post-game press conference. But it's just a shocking performance. And we, we haven't seen Gonzaga like this all season, as you all mentioned off the top. Usually, they're the team that's doing this to other teams and just absolutely blowing them out of the water from the gates. So it's a disappointment for them that the season ends like this as they hadn't lost until the championship game. But, you know, here we are and everything kind of comes to an end here. And, uh, you know, very disappointing after the remarkable season this team had. No question about that. Carthay, thank you very much.